so it could light a lot of bulbs. A lot of bulbs. Oh, I'm ready to go. Light me up. The only way to get the amount of coal that we need to supply our habit is to take off the mountain. Isn't this just a good thing for the island? Get out of the school. Okay, it's coming. Get out. This is my first solar panel. This really is a weapon in tackling our climate crisis. This is your panel coming this out right hand? here. This is mine? This is my first solar panel. It's not a silver bullet, it's silver buckshot. It's many sources of energy. I think solar is the best, yeah. but there are other sources of renewable energy as well. Did you see that? I didn't even pedal. So my CFL bulb can help conserve energy, reducing carbon dioxide emissions and the burden on coal-producing regions like Appalachia. But is there a better way to light my bulb? Sources of renewable energy like wind, solar and geothermal have been slow to spread in the US, but they're on the rise. Some people believe that alternative energy is just not going to come online. That's why I've come to Tucson, Arizona to find out for myself firsthand exactly what's going on within this sector. Here at Global Solar, they're working with a cutting-edge solar technology called Thin Film Photovoltaic. You must be Mike. I'm David. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. The cells begin as long sheets of ultra-thin, flexible steel. Okay, so it comes in on here. Yeah, and the whole roll, which you see right there... So it's like tin... It's like... It's like tin foil. Rolls of the thin metal get sprayed with copper, indium, gallium, deselenide. That's quite a mouthful. But that's what converts the solar energy into electricity. So what goes on in here? This, this, cool. is, this is the screen print room. We're taking the rolls that you saw. Yep. They've already been cut, and now they're going into the screen printing process. This machine then bakes on tiny metal grids that conduct electricity off thin metal sheets. Now this is your panel coming this out right hand? here. This is mine? Sit down. Hold, it, hold it so that you don't crinkle it. I'm not going to crinkle it. This is my first solar panel. And down here, it's curing in the oven. There's going to be a really special one coming out any minute now. The one that's crooked. Crooked. Mike says thin film solar has the potential to make solar much more user-friendly, doing away with traditional heavy panels in favor of cells that are light, flexible, and durable. And thin film could convert more energy from the same amount of sun. Solar energy is now coming online. Yes. Why has it taken so long? Well, I think it took a long time because the development, number one, took longer than people thought it would take. The cost didn't come down as fast as people thought the cost would come down. Is it coming down now? Oh, absolutely. What's going to end up happening is eventually they'll have competitive rates with coal. And uh, while they're not there yet, you know, it's getting very, very close. But what? people are starting to ask for clean electricity, aren't absolutely. they? Absolutely. Just across the road, Global Solar is building their own solar field that will provide 30% of their total energy demand. I've installed my first solar panel. So how many more have I got to go? 5,999. <laughs> wow. <laughs> when to lunch? You missed it. It was at 9 o'clock. solar. I mean, it seems like, you know, we should be moving here. We should put all our resources into solar. Well, I, I don't know that we want it all into solar, in, in all honesty. But there's nothing wrong with wind, and there's nothing wrong with nuclear, mm. and there's nothing wrong with other sources of power that aren't contaminants to the environment, so, in, in my opinion. So it's basically that old thing, to, to quote Mr. Gore, it's not a silver bullet, it's silver buckshot. It's many sources of energy. I think solar is the best, yeah. but uh, there are other sources of renewable energy as well. Which, which should be exported as well.
Mike says that as installation costs continue to come down and technology becomes more capable of storing energy, solar power will become a more reliable source to power my light bulbs.